Hey there, welcome back to Full Blast TV. I am your host, Charlie Sinan. I am your analyst, Gwen Jones, and tonight I hope you're thirsty because tonight we bring the juice, baby. Now to the matter at hand, and today's episode is the double header. Becky was today we put the details of Malisirish bathtub photos raising eyebrows and Jose Cansco filing for bankruptcy into full blast. Are you ready? Because here we go. According to Christianpost.com, a new photo of Miley Cyrus posing in a bathtub has elicited concerns about the direction the star is heading as she becomes more and more racy. Interesting enough in June Miley Cyrus announced her engagement to Liam Hemsworth, which is urging some to question whether the 19-year-old star was too young for marriage. Conversely, in a study from the Federal Centers for Disease Control and Prevention states that 24% of marriages that happen before 25 end in divorce. That number doubles for couple that marries before they turn 18. Furthermore, these figures seem to signify that many young people are not ready for the lifetime commitment of marriage and don't really recognize the sanctity and vows involved. Besides that, the latest photo of the star that has been leaked displays her posing naked in a bathtub, although not revealing herself completely, the photo is still extremely suggestive and is part of a progressively worrying trend for the teen star. Likewise, just days ago the star published another captivating photo of herself on Twitter, causing many to suggest they are unsuitable for someone who has already dedicated herself to marriage. Nevertheless, in a New York Times article about why couples divorce so young, couples in their 20s talked about why their marriages didn't last. Additionally, a man named Richard Boss said that his marriage crumbled because he and his former wife were just too young and had no clue what marriage was. Nonetheless, different professionals weighed in on why young couples face so much trouble, and two of the reasons indicated it dealt with sex and a lack of self-understanding. In addition to that, a clinical social worker with the family Service Association of Nassau County and Hempstead, Long Island, and Norma Cohen, asserted that sex can damage instead of help a marriage. Additionally, Cohen informed the New York Times previously, in the past, sex could support people over difficult periods, but now it's sold hat, and it doesn't maintain the marriage. Furthermore, Laurie Himan Gordon director of the Family Relations Institute in Falls Church, the declared that young people are emotionally not at the point to be able to identify themselves. Nevertheless, the naked photo of Cyrus was taken by photographer Vijd Mahindra and defended because it was supposedly intended for fiancé Hemsworth only. Next up Jose Cansco's bankruptcy. According to Telegram.com, the Worcester Tornado slugger Jose Cansco has filed for bankruptcy security in Nevada. Generally speaking the 1986 American League rookie of the year and 1988 league MVP with the Oakland Days is pursuing asset liquidation in Chapter 7 documents filed Tuesday in U.S. Bankruptcy Court in Las Vegas. Moreover Mark Siegel, Cansco's bankruptcy attorney, rejected to comment Wednesday. Likewise, the bankruptcy petition says the 48-year-old Kantsko lives in Las Vegas. Additionally, the filing was first reported by the Las Vegas Sun, and it lists not more than $21,000 in assets and almost $1.7 million in liabilities, including in excess of $500,000 still to pay to the Internal Revenue Service. However, Kansko has played this season for the Worcester Tornadoes and has hit 194 with a home run and seven bis. In spite of this, he 
was placed on the injured list on June the 16th and hasn't played for the Tornadoes since June the 19th. In addition to that Worcester general manager Jorg Basagios said last night Kansko is still on the injured list and still getting paid by Worcester, however he didn't give a timetable for Kansko return to the team. And for those who don't know Kanseko's highlights include being a six-time All-Star two-time World Series winner and hitting 462 home runs during 16 years on eight major league teams. Wait minute I almost forgot his most notable highlight is admitting to taking steroids. In final recap, Malicirus posting racy photos and posing has defiantly raised some worries that she overexposing herself and sending the wrong message. However what you all have to understand she celebrating her womanhood. And it's not like she doing drugs like Nicole Richie or getting Dayu or like Lindsay Lehan. Plus the bathtub photo wasn't meant to be seen by the public, it was for her fiancé supposedly. But I will say this she and her team could have done a better job preventing that photo from being leaked. Nevertheless I agree with with what some experts say about Marion Young. But I disagree about the sex part because while it may lose its allure of times to charge up the relationship, it can help put a marriage back track if there is more love, excitement and freshing up. Nevertheless when comes to Jose Cansco life is tough, but it's the decision that you make that define your destiny. I am guessing life's has got to be pretty sooky for Joe's right now, for him to file for bankruptcy protection. After all it been rough couple years with legal problems, steroids, etc. However his ex-wives getting millions of dollars in the divorce settlements is worse than any smashing he got from Hong Man Choi in a fight. But at least he got job in baseball to fall back on. Well time to close out. Well it's that time again guys for a spicy segment. So Charlie what's Miley Cyrus best asset besides her face, her breast or her legs? It's tough while I would dip her legs in barbecue sauce, I'd prefer her breast with whipped cream. In all seriousness we want to wish Miley and Liam a happy marriage. And to all the young people out there thinking about getting married so soon, please take your time. Because you do not want to dive into anything you will regret later. Make sure it's the right time and the right person. Well this ends today's show I am Charlie Sun and signing off. And be sure to catch the next episode on a full blast TV. Good night everyone I am Gwen Jones signing off. Oh and don't forget to comment rate us and subscribe at the top. Until next time.